I'm Jill Fitzhenry. My name is Kylie Fitzhenry. This, this is my granddaughter. How old are you, Kylie? <laughs> Four. And have we been painting together for a long time? Yeah, we had all, all stuff. And do you like painting with Grandma? I like What are we going to paint today? This. Oh, <gasps> that. And we painted that a while ago together, didn't we? So we're going to do another one similar to this today together. We have all the decorations. Show this them the is brush. the brush. And we're going to do a stencil brush too. And we're going to paint it carefully. Okay, so should we get started? Sure, let's get on the started. Okay. Come on, guys. Okay, Kylie, are you ready to start? Yeah? What's your favorite color? Pink. Pink? Mine too. No, you like blue one now. Oh, <laughs> and this color is cotton candy. It's Americana. It's an acrylic. So let's squeeze some out on the plate. Okay, so we're going to use our Dynasty brush. And we're going to go ahead and paint the entire board. Nice job. Now this is going to take two coats and in between we're going to let it dry and we'll use some sandpaper to sand in between the coats. So we're going to finish base coating this entire piece with the pink and we're going to let it dry. Okay, so we base coated the wood and then we took sandpaper and we just lightly sanded it and then we put another coat of paint on, right? So we want to put some glitter at the bottom of this. So we're going to take some tape and we're going to put tape at the bottom of our wood piece so that we don't accidentally get paint in there. And let's do it up on the top too, okay? We'll take some tape and let's tape it there so we don't accidentally get anything in there. Okay, so now we're going to stencil. And we have um, a stencil that has all different words on it. And Kylie picked out the words she liked. Dream, laugh, and hope. Those are the ones she said she liked. How about if we put dream up here? Does that look like a good spot? Okay, we're going to do it at an angle. And we're going to tape it down so it doesn't wiggle on you. And then we'll put some tape uh, down below too so we don't accidentally go into the next word. That way we can just keep it right there. Here, I'll put a little one here too. All right, so now we're just gonna use a darker pink. This is also acrylic and Yep, so you're going to really load it up, squish it in there like that, do it a little more, and then we're going to wipe it all off because we want this to be nice and dry. So let me show you here, sweetie. See the towel? We're going to squish it and we're going to wipe it all off and just go like that a little bit just to make sure that there's no paint. Now, and I better move that or we're going to have our elbow. Okay, now when you do this, just don't squish. Just a real gentle circle. Give it a shot. Real gentle circle. That's it. Good job. There you go. And do all the letters in dream. Do you like to dream? Yeah. Do you, what do you dream about? Do you dream about good things? Yeah, unicorns. Unicorns. That's an awesome thing to dream about. We like unicorns, don't we? You're doing a good job. Stay right in the letters. A little goes a long way. This is the Dynasty Stencil Pro that she's using. And I'm going to do just a little bit more there, sweetie, just to make sure we've got enough color in all the letters. But you did an awesome job. So this is the one quarter inch. They come in all different sizes. Now how about we see? Okay, should we pick it up and peek? Should we peek, see what we got? Oh, look what we got. We got dream. Oh, now, let's see. We want laugh. Should we put laugh over here? Here's laugh. 
Let me get this tape out of the way. And we're just going to angle them at different angles. So any kind of, let's get the tape off of there. We'll put some new tape down. Okay, let's cover up the other word below it so we don't get in there. Okay, and let me load this for you. You did a good job. And we get the extra off, squish it all off. All right. Go ahead and go in those. So straight up and down and just a little circle like that. Good job. There you go. Awesome job. Yeah, and you just want to be careful not to get too much paint on the brush because otherwise it might go under the stencil. I think that's perfect. Let's see. Let's take a peek. There we go. That's gorgeous. Now one more word and it is hope. That's a good word, isn't it? Should we put it like right there? Is that a good spot? Yes. And then we're going to put some flowers on, aren't we? Let's tape that down. And I'll help you hold it just a little bit so we'll get a little more paint on. And then after we put the paint on, what do we do? Put it on me. Do we get rid of some of it? Yeah, we squish it between the towel, get rid of the, all the extra paint, right? Okay, so I'm going to hold that end down for you. Little circle and do the word hope. Nice. That's it. All right, should we peek? Mm -hmm. Do we think we got it? Let's peek. Oh, there it is. Awesome. Uh, okay, then we decided we wanted some flowers on. But so we wanted the roses. You, you want the rose. So we do the rose. Now these are um, I, some sticky, self-sticking stencils that I found. And there's lots of stencils that you can get all over the place. How about right about there? Let's put it right in the empty spot right there. So these will stick real careful. Okay, let's just keep doing the same color. All right, and just take your time straight up in the air. Let's go right up in the air like that in little circles. That's it. Good job. Do the leaves and the stem and the flower. So really you only need two colors, two brushes, and then we're going to add some glitter and rhinestones because it's all about the glitter, right? We got to have glitter on everything, don't we? Do we like sparkles? Take a little peek. Let's take a peek. Oh, beautiful. Should we do another one? Should do the same flower. Should we put yeah. one up here? You like the rose? Okay, get a little more paint on. Wipe the extra off. Okay, take your time. Little circle. That's it. Good job. You are a very good artist. Just go slow, take your time, get the stem. Yeah, and just keep doing circles and it'll come off. There you go, that's good. What do you think? Should we take a peek? All right. Oh, beautiful. Now I put this. Now, how about we put some glitter on? You want to do some glitter? Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to take the tape off of the bottom and this time we're going to move it up a little higher. Okay, so that's how much glitter we can put on right in the bottom half there. So we're going to squish that tape down and I'm going to take the tape off of the top and now this time we're going to put it right under the scroll work. Squish that down. Okay. Oh, glitter. We like glitter, don't we? Okay, let's shake some of this out. This is the Galaxy Glitter by DecoArt. We're going to squeeze a whole bunch of this out. 
Ooh, and let's go back and get our flat brush and watch how I do it and then I'll let you do it. I want you, this time I want you to scoop it up, okay? And just on that bottom half there, and just that's it. And put a whole bunch, just kind of pat it now. You can put it on real thick. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold this up here just so we don't go uh, onto the words. I'm going to put that right there just so you remember. Okay. Good job. And if you want lots of glitter, you can actually, can I show you something? Here, let me show you. So if you want it to be a whole bunch of glitter, you can go like this and just tap. Okay. So scoop some up. And then just tap and scoop some more because we want a whole bunch. And just scoop. There you go. And that's it. It was flattering it yeah. Good job. Um, oh. Yep, yeah, no, you're okay. You're okay. Here, we'll just scoop what fell off. Flat, flat, Where's the spot? Can you get it? Oh, no, that's on top of the tape, so we're okay. That's why we put the tape there. But the tape is clear, so let's pull the tape off. Let's take a peek. All right, let's move the stencil. See now how I had tape? And when I pull the tape off, I'm gonna go at an angle. Let's see if you can see that. Let me lift it up in the air a little bit. Instead of pulling straight, I'm gonna tip it at an angle, pull it off, and see we have a nice straight line. Let me get rid of my tape. Let me turn this around so everybody else can see. But see, we have a nice, nice straight line. There we go. Get it on the bottom. Now we have to do glitter on the top. Or should we do those first? Should we do the rhinestones yeah. first and then the glitter on the top? So these are self-sticking. So just squish down hard. Little rhinestones. Good job. I'm going to turn it upside down so you don't get your arm in the glitter, honey. How about like that? Good job. Okay, and put some over here maybe in the middle. Beautiful. Are they diamonds? Do princesses all have to have diamonds? What do you think? Nice. That looks great. How about one right here too? Find the big empty spots. Yeah, somewhere in there. Nice. Where else? Oh, how about right here? We need another one there. Yeah. Maybe one over here. There you go. That looks great. On a lot. Yeah, how about one in here, in that spot too then, if you want a lot. Right in the middle there. And I think maybe one more down here. Right below the, the word. Yeah, let's turn it around. Let's take a look. Let's take a I'm peek. Put one on my Ooh. Look at my cheek. Oh, you got one on your cheek. <laughs> Where's mine? Don't I get one? Do I get one on my cheek? Did it stick? <gasps> there, we both got beautiful little rhinestones on our cheek. Okay, yeah, we want to get some glitter up on top here too. Do you want to do it or you want me to do it? I want to do it. There you go. Go ahead. <gasps> that looks beautiful. Okay, so right up on that part. Good job. Get all the little fancy areas. That's it. And scoop up some more. Nice. Now, once you're done painting, we want to wash our brushes really good, soap and water. In fact, the stencil brush, until I get a chance to um, clean it good, I'm going to put it in some water so the paint doesn't dry in the bristles. And I just use whatever soap I have at the sink, so dish soap, pan soap. Okay, one more scoop. I see one more spot here. There. This is beautiful. I think... We are going to call it done. What do you think? Do you like it? I do. It's beautiful. You did a good job, Kai.